it seems cramming has become a way of life for Team Pilipinas. Pressed again for time, the national team has scheduled practices on Saturday and Sunday, unmindful of the wrath of Typhoon Ampong as it scrambles to prepare for its closed door game against Qatar in the FIBA World Cup qualifiers on Monday. The Nationals finally arrived in the country early Saturday morning as Metro Manila and the rest of northern Luzon were being battered by the Super Typhoon. The team hardly had the benefit of a complete rest yet as its flight from Dubai to Manila was delayed for 12 hours due to inclement weather. The Philippine contingent immediately left Tehran shortly after its 81-73 loss to Iran in the first of its two-game schedule in the fourth window of the qualifiers. But with time running out, coach Yang Giao has scheduled a 5-7 p.m. Victoria Sports practice on Saturday and 4-6 p.m. on Sunday, Moralco. The team is currently billeted at Novital and will have its team viewing two hours before practice on Saturday. Meanwhile Qatar has also arrived in the country and is booked in a hotel in Ortigas, according to Sam Hang Basketball NG Pilipinas executive director Sonny Barrios. The crammed schedule is almost the same experience the national team underwent prior to its campaign in the recent 18th Asian Games, when the Filipinos only had four days of practice in Jakarta, Indonesia, before plunging into action against Kazakhstan for their first game. The usual problem, Piro Sane Nateo said Giao about the team facing another tight schedule before playing a game. Team Pilipinas remained in third place in Group F at 4-3 despite the loss to Iran, which is at no. 2, 6-1, behind Australia, 6-1. Japan comes next at number 4, 3-4, after stunning Kazakhstan, 3-4, in Almaty. 85-70. Qatar is at the bottom of the standings with a 2-5 record as it lost to Australia at home, 95-43.